After his duel with Obi-Wan on Mustafar that left him scarred for his entire life, Darth Vader would fully embrace the dark side of the Force, adopting a whole new persona, a new look and a bigger role as Palpatine's enforcer during the time of the Galactic Empire. Considering that by his own wrongdoing he caused the loss of everything he cared about in Padme Amidala, Darth Vader agreed with the role as the Emperor's right hand and main enforcer. It was during that time that he was also made aware of the secret construction of the Death Star, which was to be supervised by Grand Moff Tarkin. Among others, one of Vader's earliest missions on the Emperor's behalf was to effect an execution on Murkana. Known throughout the Empire of being the Emperor's enforcer, few knew his real identity, and even fewer assumed he had once been Anakin Skywalker. His image at the Imperial Court and the favor he enjoyed from the Emperor led many Imperial officers to dislike Vader and his position of power. They hated him for seemingly emerging out of nowhere and being placed above them in the grading due to his link with his master. On the other hand, Vader was held in high appreciation by the Stormtrooper Corps for frequently fighting alongside them at the front line. He would risk his own life rather than remain in command centers. Vader also had strong support from the pilots of the new Imperial Navy. From the position of the Emperor's Enforcer, Vader regained command of the unit he had been in charge of during the Clone Wars as Anakin Skywalker, the 501st Legion. When the Emperor discharged the clone troopers, the rank and file of the 501st was made up of recruited stormtroopers, some of whom were trained by the Dark Lord himself, such as Sergeant Creel, a hidden agent whom Vader trained in lightsaber fight. Through many of their missions who were executed on Vader's behalf, the 501st came to be known as Vader's Fist. Alright guys, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you like this one, don't forget to leave a thumbs up down below and subscribe if you haven't already and don't miss out on any of my future videos that I will post on this channel. Have a fun day my friends and in closing, don't forget, may the force be with you always.